G'day, uh, my name's David Elliott and uh, I'm here to uh, talk today a little bit about a uh, long-necked uh, plesiosaur, a member of the uh, lasmosaur. And uh, this little particular specimen was, uh, it's come from west of Winton and uh, we've got about six metres of fossil here. So going from the full length of the body, um, we're looking at about six metres long, it's got a complete skull. And, uh, and the complete neck. So there's 55 vertebrae in this neck and uh, you can look at uh, all the little gaps in here. This is very, very badly preserved at this section, but we were able to save the whole specimen and uh, it is 100% it is complete on the neck and uh, 55 vertebrae long. So you look at the, the length of this neck is, is uh, around about four and a half meters long and this animal if we had the whole animal, would be about nine metres long. So it's the only plesiosaur that, uh, or only, well, it's the only one in Australia that has got a skull and the complete neck attached to it and some body. Um, if the only other one that's got anything is a, is a skull with some neck, few neck vertebrae and that's it. So there's a huge amount of scientific information in this one. So uh, when you look at the the length of this neck, see it's getting thicker all the way. And this is about where the neck finishes here and we're starting to get into the body. So these are the ribs. This, this was just preserved as one big concretion, a big, big tubular rock. And these bones, that were ribs that were coming off here, they weren't preserved in the concretion. So they were, they've all broken off. Um, but the rest of the animal is missing. It was, just wasn't preserved in the first place. And if you're wondering what this piece up is here, this is a white bone, this one's brown. This piece was on the surface, so it's come to the top of the ground, which has flagged the fact that this was below. But whereas this was all the white is what was inside the concretion, and we prepped that rock off in the, in the laboratory. So uh, this specimen is mounted by Laurie Byrne. Um, Laurie was with the Queensland Museum for many, uh, many years, uh, did a lot of amazing work there, and he's been working on mounting this mount here. So what this is, is this is polystyrene. So these are polystyrene blocks that have been shaped to fit the bones. The bones fit into the polystyrene blocks. And then the whole, the whole um, base has then been cut, coated in a product called Hydrocal. And so what uh, Laurie has done then is uh, then smoothed it all off and, and it's all been painted. So it's a beautiful specimen, it's a beautiful job and uh, probably uh, yeah, one of the more complete plesiosaurs in Australia.